Hey everybody, welcome back to Zach Tech Reviews. On this channel we look at tech, mobile accessories and gadgets and I finally decided to join the home automation revolution here and I picked up a Google Home and a Google Home Mini speaker here. But as you probably already know, they're a smart home speaker. You can ask questions, set timers, get information, play music. That's what I plan on using with this mostly. And also uh, control different devices in your home. So turning light switches on or off, lamps, TVs, different devices, things like that. But let's break into these boxes here and I'll show you guys what comes inside of both of these. So let's start with the Google Home. This is the regular size one here. It's quite nice packaging here. Uh, on the side, you're gonna see all the different uh, apps and things like that that work with it, particularly for myself. I'm gonna be using it for Google Play Music and Netflix. So let's go ahead and get into it. Top just comes off like so. Opens up like this. Really nice presentation. And there's our speaker right there. It's got some nice weight to it. Nice rubberized bottom here. Looks like we've got an input here for our power. And that's it really kind of straightforward it looks quite nice so put that there let's see what else we have inside the box lifting this up inside we have some instructions here from Google Play as well as power brick as well as power brick right here so there's power brick and that will all plug in looks quite nice great packaging job by Google by the way and here's the Google Home Mini let's go ahead and get into this here on the bottom here, there's a pull tab. Go ahead and pull that. Let's open this up and inside our Google Home Mini. So big size difference there. You can look at that. You can see that big size difference here. So this does everything that this does right here, but it's a smaller size. Obviously comes at a better price point. Um, I've also heard that the sound quality is not as good on something like this. This is more for small rooms, dorms, offices, things like that, which is perfect because I plan on putting this one in my bedroom and this one right here will go in my office instructions power cable looks like power cable right here it's, it's attached and there we go so we got google home we got google home mini if you guys want to know how to set up and how to use these right away i'll leave a link down below for another creator's video you can go ahead and check them out but what i want to know from you is what home automation should i get into right away and so let me know down in the comments there what should i start with and uh, I'll go out and I'll get the products and we'll set it up and I'll show you guys how it all works and we'll go from there. If you guys like the content here, please leave a thumbs up. It would be appreciated. Think about hitting that subscribe button as well and we'll catch you in the next one. Take care. Cheers.